hi there everyone today in this video i would tell you about the 1.5 kilowatt solar off-grid power pack system this is a more than one year old system which was about one kilowatt but now the consumer wants more output from this off-grid system so we have increased two more panels in this system so it became 1.5 kilowatt since once one solar panel is about 250 watt each so here is the setup of all the four five six panels the site is located in Bangalore the structure is facing the south side and the time is about five in the evening so here are the two set of new panels and uh, the structure is quite complicated since it's an old one here you can see the specification of the panels which were installed last year the VOC is 37.98 volt and the current is about 8 amps so here is the DC box which was designed for 1 kilowatt that's why it is having only 4 DC fuses and the rating of the fuses are 1000 volt 32 amps so what we have done it's all connected in parallel all the panels so in each uh, one of the fuses we have uh, attached other panels plus positive sides and the negative sides so it doesn't make any difference since all the positive points are going to become one on the bus bar so here you can see the rating of the fuse it's going there and becoming a single point on this bus bar or this bus bar is containing all the positive points of the panels so it's becoming a one single wire and in the same way all the negative wire are coming from this side to this black piece and it is becoming one and going down so we have one plus wire one negative wire going down towards the UPS now let's check the voltage it's about evening let's see the voltage what is the output see in uh, what happens is in parallel connection the voltage would remain the same but the current would increase and when we are connecting the grid system it's the panel are all in series so the voltage increases but the current remains the same see the voltage is about 32.8 something in the range rated voltage of the panels since it is dropping it's evening time it's dropping so but it's enough to show you the output so it's 32.8 all color six panel connected in parallel okay now this is the UPS this is the, are the two wires something 530 in the evening let's see the output is 29.54 something on the two wires which we showed you plus one and the minus one it's connected with the solar UPS these are the two batteries let's see what's behind okay here we have a cooling heat sink fan for the electronics inside <laughs> one output port is there you can see it's mentioned output so where the DC is converted into AC stored uh, first the DC is directly stored into the battery from there it is converted into inverter from DC to AC and supplied to the load so this is the power point let's check the voltage whether polarity is right or not okay it's polarity is okay let's reverse it it will be shown in the multimeter uh, yes the polarity is correct as labeled in the UPS okay so here are the two DC wires positive and the negative one connected at the same time the UP is also connected with the grid in case if there is no solar output and the battery is not able to charge the load would be directly connected with the grid here is the solar port here are the batteries see one red and black wire from the bottom it's going towards the batteries and batteries connected in series it's mentioned 24 volt DC each battery is about 
12 volts so connecting in series then become 24 volts and the voltage we saw coming out of the panel was about 37 something that is more than the voltage of the battery so we know potential difference higher the from higher to lower side it flows so that is why it's charging the DC batteries the batteries are DC volt and the current out coming out of the PV is also DC so that is the concept of charging here is the port for AC which is connected with the grid and the black thick wire is for the grid so the first priority given by this system is the output of solar then the batteries and then when the battery drains up it is finally shifted to the load side grid power so here okay you can see in the display the PV voltage is about 31.3 volt 636 kilowatt the contrast is too much for the videos I'm very sorry about that so this is the off-grid system 1.5 kilowatt we came for inspection we changed the distilled water of the batteries that is more important to get the maximum backup from